Now, the most accurate weather team in Florida, ABC Action Weather. How are you doing, everybody? Still looking at a decent chance of rain across the area. Clouds on the increase, and eventually that bumps up our rain chances pretty significantly both Saturday and Sunday. Now, right now, I'm thinking the best rain chances will be north of I-4, but obviously there will be some breaks in the rain, so I'm not ready to say it's going to rain all day on Saturday or Sunday. It's one of those things. It's a really good idea to check your app, look at the radar, look at our Facebook updates, because we can give you a window, two, three, maybe four hours of drier weather, at least if you have to get something done outdoors. I do think Sunday another area of rain comes in, digging in from the north, potentially even a few stronger storms. So overall rainfall totals are pretty significant for the next five days. And that's what's interesting about this air mass. It's not going anywhere. So I mean, I think we're looking at the same setup right through Wednesday. But again, the hour by hour into the overnight hours. Notice between about 3 a.m. and 7 a.m. first thing on Saturday, those showers roll right in again. Here's Florida's most accurate seven day forecast. 60% rain chances right through the middle of next week. No changes each day. Highs upper 80s to low 90s. I think by the end of the period, though, finally, that's the end of July, early August, we finally get back to normal with more sunshine and more of those late day storms.